because I've never amounted to anything in life. Don't you waste your time listening to him? Frank what if he's right? Frown. What if I never make it on the radio? Hey, listen to me. Baby, I'll whatever you believe you can... Not that again, Ma. I mean, come on, look around. We're homeless. We're so broke that we can't even afford a Walkman. How am I supposed to be on the radio if I can't even listen to it? Child. What are you doing? Oh, he is a radio Just person. Come on over here. Come on. What? What? Here. Now, I wasn't going to give you this until your birthday next week, but I guess you can have it now. What is it? Just open it. You got me a walker? But how? I thought we didn't have the money. You don't worry about that. I made it happen. And besides, how in the world are you supposed to be on the radio if you can't even listen to it? <laughs> I can't believe this. Thank you, Ma. But, Ma, do you really think I'm gonna make it? Or are you just saying that to make me feel better? Videos like these are really good, but they're also really bad because I can't make any jokes because it's just sad. <laughs> I can't, I can't make any jokes about this. It's just sad. Listen to me, baby. Do you believe that you can? Yeah. Well, then always remember this. What you believe, you can achieve. This, I can promise you. And I want you to take this with you as a reminder. Anytime that you need it, okay? I will. And if I ever succeed. When you succeed. <laughs> when I succeed. I'm gonna buy you a house and you never have to be homeless again. Thank you, baby. I'm serious. We won't ever have to worry about being evicted or having the sheriff tell us to pack our things. I promise. I believe you, baby. And I love you with everything in me. I love you too, Ma. Kurt is more inspired than ever to become the biggest voice on radio again. He uses his new Walkman to listen to the radio every chance he gets, imagining himself on air. Even as he gets older, he never forgets about his dream. He gets a job as a bouncer so he can meet lots of new people. Eventually, he meets the right person who happens to work at a radio station. He gives Kurt a chance to host a small nighttime talk show. Kurt couldn't believe he was finally gonna be on the radio. That guy looks like he works with Black Panther. Like he's about to, like he's, he's like, come to, come to Wakanda, you know? <laughs> you can be the radio host. <laughs> he's got like the, the Black Panther uh, suit on. The night of the show, Kurt's so excited to get started. That is, until people at the station stare and laugh at him. They call him names, they write mean messages, and even tell him that he'll never make it long term on radio. Kurt was so upset. He leaves the show thinking he'll never work in radio again. But then he runs into someone that would change his life forever. Frank, I don't know what I was thinking. What, me have my own radio talk show? That ain't never gonna happen. Hey, watch it, man. My bad, man. Wait, big boy. You know, why do you seem so upset? I mean, I'm fine, man. Come on, come on, wait. Come on, man. Look. You can tell me. What's going on? Well, Creed, I thought I could be on the radio, the but the station place. practically laughed at me. 
Okay, so? Why are you so surprised? What, what, what do you mean? <laughs> I mean, man, look at you. Didn't I tell you you would never amount to anything in life? I mean, but hey, look at the bright side. At least you won't have to pay rent when you're homeless. <laughs> man, all that time, man, Frank's Maybe still right. a jerk. Maybe I'll never make it. Oh, man, my Walkman! What you believe, you can achieve. This, I can promise you. Wow. Wow. That's it. Wow. I, I can't stop believing in myself. I came too far. I'm gonna lose this weight and I'm gonna be the best radio DJ ever. Remembering his mom's words, Kurt gets more excited than ever to go after his dream again. He goes back to radio. And this time, when people make fun of him, he doesn't care. He never stops believing in well, his- Oh, look, I have that microphone right here. Hold on a second. I got, I got that microphone right here. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Self. <laughs> he keeps doing radio, and as time goes on, he becomes the number one radio host in Los Angeles with Big Boy's Neighborhood. He signs a major deal with the network and interviews some of the most famous celebrities in the world. He finally accomplishes his dream of becoming the biggest name in radio. Oh my god! Oh my gosh, big boy! We love your show. We even got your merch. Oh, that's amazing. Thank you. I want to be just like you when I grow up. But I don't know. Everybody keeps saying that I'll never amount to anything in my you life. Y'all, thank you, Till Crusade. You know, I feel you. I heard the same thing growing up, but I never let that stop me. By who? Well, hello, big boy. Frank? Yeah, it's my grandson. Turns out he's a big fan of yours. Look, uh, I'm really sorry for the way that I treated you. I was wrong. But it turns out you really did make something of your life. Well, thank you, Frank, and I appreciate that, but... Actually, man, I should be thanking you. Thanking me? For what? All those things you said to me, Frank, all the negativity, the bad stuff that you would say about me, it's got me going. It made me work even harder, so... It actually helped me succeed. I love that. Mr. Big Boy, do you think I could ever make it on radio? Let me ask you this. Do you believe you can? Well, yeah. Well, if you believe, you can achieve. And I know this. He's gonna give him the Walkman. Yeah, because there a wise woman told me so. You take that. Oh my God. Thank you. You keep that, and whenever you need a reminder, you pull that out, and you just take a look at it. I'll never forget this. You be good, little soldier. Bye, Queen. All right, Frank. Yeah. <laughs> Bye, Frank. Mom. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh. Hey, Mama. Now I got a little surprise for you. All right. Okay. But you got to put this on. What? He bought her a house, oh, didn't he? Oh. Okay. Well, where are we going? Child. You'll see. Lord. You'll see. Oh. A little bit more, come. I got you. I got you. I got you. Oh, okay. Right. Okay. That's perfect. Child now you can take it off. Okay. Okay. Oh. A house. Well, that's the same house understand. all the other people lived in. Wait, what? It's your house, Mama, and it's paid for. A lot of people live in so the you house. Don't have to worry about somebody.